What is up, y'all? XSC Xeno Supreme Canadian coming back with you with SRP 2.0. We're jumping in back with Nurse Candy again. But uh, I think today we're gonna have a good patrol. Even though it might look seem slow, but you know, it, it, I have a feeling it's gonna get be better. We got our Echo out, Echo One up front. A little advertisement. But um, yeah, we have a lot more. We got a little bit more stuff to do. We'll just go up here, put the little T, and then we'll do our Control V. Put our ad out there saying that, hey, Nurse Nancy, not Nurse Nancy, Nurse Candy is here and ready. You know what I mean? First things first. It's you know first the start of the patrol. Let's go get ourselves a coffee. Well bottle of water I gotta I gotta arrange my stuff around I had to get stuff set up before patrol so that's why my pockets are all busy so I gotta put that back in there because you know we don't have food in in this area oh let me take the three out here let me take the three out put the six in good enough good cool let me have a let me have a bottle of water a little healthy than in coffee. I don't want to. They don't need brown tea before patrol. Before we before we have patients here. So this last patrol, this put this thing burned down. So we don't have that anymore. It's garbage anyways. Should we have grab more? Oh, what do we? Oh, I need a backpack. I gotta put my money in. Oh, let's go give it. Let's go give that to Doctor Avery. Hold on. I have not showed you Dr. Avery yet. Dr. Avery, Avery's in here. See, watch. Good afternoon, Dr. Avery. Yeah, you, you don't look like Dr. Avery today. You look like, uh, I don't know. We'll just call you Mr. Clean today. Dr. Clean, that's what your name is now today. Okay, okay. Dr. Clean. All right, so I don't want to be carrying this around all day, so this is going to get dropped right here. Knife, just in case the patient goes crazy on me. I'm joking. So let's put down here with my yeah, duck over right there for right now. We'll put this in our pocket. Oh, no, I was going to put that out. No, wait. Money. Four. Oh, wait. Else, if I had zero, oh, yeah, my dirty cuffs from last patrol. Yeah, there you go. All right, so I found out more of more things we can do in the in the. In the did you eat the did you eat the banana? Did you eat the banana? It's really rotten over there, honey. Check this out. Look how rotten this banana is. Yeah, she had black lines on there, and that means it's been. What is that? Hair grounds? That's nasty. You at least got an apple. You got an orange. What's this green shit in here? Sir, are you drinking green sludge? That's probably why you got the poops these days. Alright. We're gonna go over here. So I think Ward B door is still locked on my for me, right? Oh, it's open. Sweet. Is this is this a fake door? Probably is. Okay, so what I found out. So we okay. So let me let me do a walk around again for those who haven't seen. So this is our uh, intensive care. So. You know, when patients are done, they come over. And they'll come in here, and or if you have to do a, like a nice checkup, it's like you know they come in here to sit on the bed while we do their checkup. And then we have OR one, so OR one. This one, this one is more or less if we're doing a cask. Cast. You know, you got the drill there. Or we're putting plates in type deal. So that's OR1. OR2 is the middle one. 
this is where I can take out the bullet if there's anybody that comes in with bullets or you know something like you know small some needles stuff taking out come in here or or1 is this, I guess we'll just turn this into a burn victim or because of the fact that um, we do have a TV there and then we have the red you know medicine and all this other stuff so that's or1 and then if the people do come in for an x-ray we can come down here what's this one MRI so if, you know we can do this MRI thing here get them lay on this and then we'll go over here we'll, we'll come in here while they're in there and then we'll just do our MRI thing there boom done same thing over here you'll have your x-ray machine we can do our x-rays like nothing that's kind of cool Oh yeah, User joined your channel. Someone joined my channel. Yeah, Travis. Can you four? Right, so I am looking to place a call. I want to send my ambulance over here to restock. Oh, okay. At the hospital? Ten four. So what are you playing? A doctor or a nurse? Nurse Candy. Nurse Candy. Perfect. I'm going to place a call. Actually, I'm going to send them. I'm not even going to place a call. I'm going to tell them to meet up with Nurse Candy at Pillbox, and you're going to act like you're going to give them a box and you're giving them supplies. And it should have come with a checklist, right? Correct? It should have what? A checklist? No, no, no. It's just a little interaction with you. That's all. Okay. Yeah, yeah. You could just like grab a clipboard and say, all right, guys, I need you to sign for this. You want to go through the box and make sure that everything's there. Okay, if you do send them, send them to upper. Upper. Okay, perfect. At the the reception, right? Yes. Nurse Candy, right? Nurse Candy. It's gonna. Yeah, thank you. All right, I'll send them over there. Yeah, because I have over about I have about over four hundred uh, slash me's and do's and slash rps things to make, really make this go good. Sure, man. That's, this is an awesome idea. I was just trying to explain that's an awesome idea. They're not hearing me or you plan this, okay? So don't worry. Um, I, If I don't have to ask for uh, Brian, do you, you think you can send some uh, bandages down? Oh, sure. I'll, 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 yeah, I'll let them give you that. Yeah, sure. About maybe 10, maybe? Just in definitely. case. Thank you. Definitely. Definitely. Okay. All right. Have fun. You too. You left your channel. It's Chief Otango, or Captain Otango, or or oh no, yeah, Otango, Otando. So yeah, there's our X-ray machine. So we've been there. So this is the other thing I kind of like. Um, this one would be. All, I'm just gonna call this an off-limits area. So like. You know, no one else should be back here unless you're higher, up, you know, high up. But um, we have like a private room if we have to for patients. Like, you know, if someone, you know, multiple victims type deal. It's kind of like an old school type, you know. But this one, I have an I, I have, so I, I have a plan RP for this one. So this one I have planned with Tui. Um, we have something planned for this, so we're gonna use this room very well. Um, I love it. I just love everything on this. All right, so let's head back to front. Oh wait. Wait. It's a big hospital. I get turned around a lot. Uh, 
All right, so we have to sit in this chair because of the fact that the other chairs act weird. All righty. Oh, is a supply closet. Actually, let's go look for the supply closet since um, we got people coming down for an order. Um, pretty sure the supply closet for EMS would be. Is this EMS closet? Yeah, closet. Yeah, so EMS closet there. Oh, that was just making sure. You know what we did? You know what we did on this patrol? We got everything ready before patrol. There we go. We already have 10 people on the third. Well, I'm not, we're 24 on. Not bad. Yeah, we got near Civ. Look at that, Carson T. Kind of, I'm kind of enjoying this. I don't know. Um, so the doctor stuff we're gonna keep up. Hello, Seno. How you doing? Um. So my plan is, I want to get I want to get a couple more staff, and I want to so see the one person I want to bring on to my staff to bring John on. I want John to be one of my doctors. Like, you know, like you know how you send those like little doctors. You know, you send those doctors in to check over the patient, and then they send the the bigger nurse in or the bigger doctor type deal. You know the higher up doctor. I would like to do something like that, but like have John play that one. He did the the one character from, um, you know the one he did from the strip club strip club one, and that kind of accent type thing. He, I know he does it really well, so it'd be kind of cool to bring a doctor type in, and say he's like from Liberty City type deal. And oh my god. But I have, so like I was telling Angel when he popped in, I do have over 300 slash me slash slash do slash uh, RP. So like, um, so I'm going to try something different tonight. See if anybody likes it type deal. So if anybody bring, comes in where they usually have to do the T slash RP, I can do that for them where I'll put their name in. Um, and I'll make them, you know, so like, so I'll give, I'll give you an example. Uh, where's my doctor script? Here's my doctor script. So we have, well, let's see, we have T slash uses hand sanitizer, uses slash me puts in on large medical gloves and medical mask. Um, so then when the patient comes in, 
the brief permit we'll get this from EMS so it'll be like T slash me looks at patient medical form for name what do I find and like I, I put in like some I put in the forms where it'd be easier for someone that's not doing EMS and that so like um, so like if I do T slash blood pressure cuff uh, yeah you know T slash me run runs not run runs blood pressure cuff what do I find um, you know slash me checks vitals so this is what well, this is going to do too it's going to help me get ready for my um, EMS for reserve so I have my blood sugar stuff I have my surgery stuff I keep hearing like someone walking around. Um, oh yeah, so the one of the T slash RPs I have would be like, okay, so T slash RP based off Nurse Candy's authorization, patient is was brought into pillbox medical by Los Angeles EMS. The patient, the patient brought in was whatever the name is and then they will be in surgery then will be moved to the recovery room please stand by for questioning okay so now i do my stuff and then once i'm done i'll say slash rp nurse candy and her medical team at pillbox was successful on blank surgery and has been transferred over to the recovery room will be ready for local sheriff department to speak with the individual for questioning you know fuck it. we're kind of really you know working this out um you know let's say there's one of those ones like ben oh wait like ben that likes to kill off some of his characters so let's we'll say someone comes in and want to like put their character away for a bit so then i'll go like this t slash nurse candy and her medical team uh a pillbox was somewhat successful on surgery and has been uh blank has no way pillbox was somewhat successful on blank surgery and has been transferred over to the recovery room um, whatever the name is, but will not be able to speak to the local sheriff department due to individual having some complications. So that means, so that those ones that want to be in longer will have, you know, like a somewhat like, hey, I can't talk type deal. Um, but still... You know... I didn't realize everybody left the uh, Discord anyway, so. We'll do our rounds again, so we'll. You know how I like to do it? I like to. Oh, wait, no. E. Oh, no. No, slash. E. So I can walk around my clipboard again. So we have a we have a rig coming down for restock. So until you in. Nurse Candy looks like she's like miserable. Someone left a teddy bear. I wonder if you can actually pick up the teddy bear. 
Oh, you know what? I forgot to call the RP shop. I forgot to go around to the RP shop. See if there's any medical stuff in there. Just a question. Just a question. Oh, is this a dunk? That's not pushable. It's not pushable. Okay. Look, lady, don't touch the don't touch the echo woman. Yeah, she's not from here. She's not from here. Um, let's check our fishies today, shall we? Uh, yeah, I see Dory still. Dory still haven't died. Does this actually work? It's tw almost one o'clock in game. What's the time? Oh shit, it does work. Oh, oh that's that's awesome. Oh, I didn't realize they were here already, so. They were pretty quick. Do we actually have a fax machine here? Uh, we have a printer. Wait. Oh, we do have a fax machine. So this must be Nurse Candy. Hello, honey. How you doing? I'm doing all right. How about yourself? Not too bad. Heard you needed some bandages. I heard you guys need some medical supplies, honey. Yes, we do. All right. Um, you want you want me to just walk over there? Um, but I'll take you guys to the room. Um, it's just the two boxes, right, honey, or the three? Uh, it should just be the two. Okay, so one's going to have to come back. So when I um, grab the one box, the other one's going to have to come back because the other one is uh, morphine and all that. You know, that's in the locked area. So which one's, which one's higher here? Uh, red shirt, Lieutenant. <laughs> all right, we'll, we'll get you to come back with me because it's, uh, you know, it's morphine and higher drugs, so. Yep, gotcha. Got to keep them all locked and stuff. And just so, just so uh, we can be clarified, uh, do you guys have your medical badges on you right now, honey? Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. There you go, man. Okay, honey. Um, yeah. Okay, that's a real card. All right, here you go. Oh, you're you're just you're just like a rookie type deal, huh? Okay. Yes, I am. Yeah. Okay. New to the force. No, you're new to the force. All right. All right, Cap. Uh, is it Captain? Uh, Lieutenant. Lieutenant. All right. We'll, we'll get the rookie set up with two, the other two boxes, and then we'll get your morphine in there, honey. Yes, ma'am. It's right this way, honey. Okay, rookie guy here. Um, there's two boxes in here for your guys' gloves. Oops, sorry. I, did, I, did, I know it's a short room. There's a, should be a box over there that has um, gloves, gauze, uh, sanitizer stuff, um, a new pair of scissors, you know. 
what else is in here. Let's see what's on the list here. Oh, some more medical tape. I see they okay. You guys go through a lot of medical tape, honey. Damn. Yes, we do. Um. Oh, sorry about that, honey. So you had to come back in here for a third box too, because you're apparently you guys need some more new oxygen. Uh, not the bottles, but the mask things, the fret cleaner ones, honey. So there should be one more box too there with your number on it. So three boxes total for you. All right, okay. Lieutenant, let's go. They put it all the way back here because, you know, it's a private back here. So not a lot of people come back here for the important stuff. Gotcha. Okay. Oh, slash me put in so I don't need that right now for a quick second. Okay, so Oops, we sorry. got no, oh, you're good, honey. All right, so. You guys need what four vials of morphine, four vials of uh you need some more Narcan, honey? Uh yes. Okay. And Oh, okay, I see this one. Okay, so since you're Latina, honey, I'm gonna get you to sign off on the Fanto one. But um make sure that one's locked up in the reg rig. Mm -hmm. But that's that one that only be minister if it, if it need to. Got it. You want me to sign the inventory and receivable? You did it for this one, yes, because it's you know it's it's uh, it's one of those ones that are really secure type deal, and you know uh, Sheriff D'Angelo don't like when there's stuff that was missing in here. Hello, Master Ninja. How you doing? Sorry about that. Sorry about sorry about that, Ninja. All right, there you go. Um. Alrighty, it was just these. Yes, honey. All right. Thank you very much, man. Um. I think, yeah, those needles in there for the blood sugar too, honey, to help to bring the blood sugar up and that, and your glucose to type. Oh, got it. And it did destroy the lock, honey. Don't worry. We've got gotcha. you. <laughs> okay, honey. Let's go see where the rookie is and see if we've got all three boxes, honey. Maybe I'll confuse the, the poor rookie. What did he? Get up in the sack. Yep. 
Just go ahead and put yours in, and I'll get it secured. And then one, one more thing before the rookie for the rookie to sign something. So, you know, if you know if something goes wrong, at least it's on your hands, not on not on the latina there, honey. She handled the three boxes to make sure everything is in there. So. Yep. Uh, well, the the second box, I do have a question. What was all on your list again? So you have you new respiratory. You had a new respiratory for the thing for the oxygen there, honey. And you guys have the new do new battery pack for the, you know the, um, you know the shocker machine, honey. The AEDs. Yeah. Yeah, AEDs. Then you have your new gauze. You have your 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 gloves. Your sanitizer wipes. And then a breathing tube. And then your Latina here got his uh. You guys, is, let's see, uh, the needles for your um, blood sugars. You also get um, morphine, the fentanyl. Now, like I said to the lieutenant, that make, sure, make sure that stays in the lockbox. And that's not to be worried of, because and unless, unless it's really needed, honey. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Yes, ma okay, so I'll just get you the honey. There you go. Good to hear you're doing well, Ninja. You signed off on my side. And then did uh, the chief did the chief send me uh, some bandages? Thank you, ma'am. You know you're good, honey. Did the chief uh, send those bandages down, honey? Oh yeah. Almost forgot. One second. It's just so it just uh you know if someone comes in walking in with a broken leg at least we can fix them up a little bit more. There you go. Thank you, honey. At least if it's a hot day, you know we're gonna be busy, honey. It's gonna be a hot one of those hot days, honey. So we're gonna be busy, kind of. Oh, absolutely. We're gonna have probably heat heat stroke and everything, honey. Yeah, I guess when we make our grocery run, I'll put a couple extra waters or bottle in the back just in case. Mm -hmm. All right, honey. Um, if you guys ever come in with a patient, you know I'll be at the front desk or somewhere around there, in there. Okay. Thank you. Yes, ma'am. Have a good one. All right, honey. Thank you very much. I'm digging this doctor thing big time. We got our little echo out there just in case. Alrighty, um, the other thing would be kind of cool, so once I do my reserve, I'm hoping I can be able to carry a medical bag around, and if I, I can, then, then, hey, look at that, you know, I'll do, I'll do doctor all the time, but it'd be, but it'd be nice to switch between pillbox, sand, sandy, and, no, pillbox, sandy, and what was the one up in, uh, is it Toledo? Oh, pin the wrong button again. Nope, nope. Alright, so since we dealt with boxes, we dirt, we, see, we dealt with something dirty, so we turn around, we use the hand sanitizer, wash our hands, make sure we have all that those germs off because, you know, you don't know if the, the, the fire guy was picking his errors. We need, we need clean hands, you know what I mean, honey? I don't think Latina Mike there would, but uh, you don't know about the rookie guy, you know. What was that? What was his uh, number again? EMS supply. Paper into the computer. Uh, that looks
looks like 13, isn't it? 13? So EMS 13, I guess. Actually, let me uh, let me use a little cheat sheet since I don't remember what I didn't remember. Uh, they were oh, so ambulance a car two. Okay, so go back up here, go like this. Uh, EMS, so it'll be a car two. Oh no, eight, eight, eight card, two. It's like, you know, it's the same thing as AMS, but I think it's, you know, we call it a car. I don't know. It's, it's a fire in the EMS American thing. It's a U.S. thing, I think. I think it's, a, it's whenever, you know, an ambulance is in the same station as a firehouse. I think it's, you know, a car, but it's still, it's, a car ambulance, EMA, uh, EMS rig, any same thing. Supply paper into the computer, marking. Both. Both. And then we sanitize our hands again. See if we're getting, gaining on. Yeah, look at that. We're getting numbers now. Alright, so now I'll we'll go talk to Mr. Clean. How's it going, Dr. Clean? Yeah, the fire guys came and picked up your stuff, medical stuff. Yep. Mm hmm. You're bald, you're bald again. Yeah, you're bald. Well, you're, you got a little hair on there. You got scruff on there. So I had Dr. Avery, honey. I I miss Dr. Avery. He he was a good guy. At least you wore the brown pants just in case you shoot yourself today. He is a good one. Is there actually stuff on this? Oh, we can't throw stuff out, really. Well, since that vending machine is broken, let's go get. Let's go to the other vending machine. Is the other one broke down. The other one broke. No, we got one glazed on it.
Hello, honey. How you doing? Anyone here? Really, he locked the door on me? He locked both doors. That's open. Oh. Of course they did. I locked that door. Hospital's not on lockdown anymore. Oh, this RP is that the Frank Frank the Janer 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 Dink Dan unlocked the door for me, honey. I'll wait for that to put that one up. Because I think I haven't done it for a while, so. Excuse me. Do 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 do. Did he? Did the ambulance guys come back in? Services, services. Oh, there's taxi on here. Somebody want a taxi?
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, well, we'll just wait for call someone to come in here. Which one's what? No looking. Oh, no looking. No looking. Does the man actually? Does the man side actually have urinals? Oh. Oh, in the man's bathroom. Oopsie daisy. Um, we can always do a fire call soon. Like a sign alarm. You know, yeah, we'll probably do, that's what we'll probably do, we'll probably give him a call, we'll probably be like, um, actually I want to see if there's, um, I want to see if there's a circuit board, like a fire circuit board. Oh yeah, I forgot the third lock. That's the only thing. Oh. There's a Healy flying over.
I was wondering something about something. Oh. Well, last time someone popped up right there, so that's why I... wonder, can I put my hair up on the button? Man, 
let me tell you, like we're 60 and don't act like we're 60. Oh. Uh, that's why I guess it's not plugged in anymore. It'd be kind of cool if you can carry blankets in that. So I can bring like extra blankets around. So one of the emotes I was thinking about. So like for props. Okay, so. You know, let's say. Um, you know, somebody's in ICU and they're hungry. I can bring them a. Oh, I know that's for me. Never mind. But, oh, that's Doug. Look, honey, it's your birthday. You want a cake for your birthday, honey? It's a unicorn cake, man. Congratulations, honey. You can feel a lot better today. Let me give you a balloon. What's a bagel? Oh, okay, you're eating a bagel. Oh, okay. Blackjack. Uh, no, no. Christmas coffee mug. Oh, you can do a walkie talkie, that's. Nurses do have walkie talkies. Some of them do of your. Uh...
See, honey, this is why I do all the AI work. I work at the I work at Pillbox Medical, honey. Yeah. I'm a, every day, every night, I work at Pillbox all day. See, see. You see this right here, honey. This is where, you know, the the, the that machine caught fire, honey. And in this one, this, these are fishies. Check this. These are these are these are fishies. We have a lot of fishies in here. And then there's there's this there's there's Miss there's Miss Candy. No, no, that my, no, my my name is Miss Candy. But that means that's Miss Jackie back there. Yeah, and then then this is a reception area where we all sit and sit there and just talk about random stuff, you know, you know. Mhm. Mm yeah. And these are our phones. We have we got some we got some pay phones still, even though we're all the new technology and all that, you know. Yeah. Yeah. You know, we'll come back to this one in a few minutes. Okay. Okay. Damn cameras. You know, you guys talking to them like they're like so you're sick of nature. How you doing, honey? How you feeling, Miss Dory? You feeling like shit again, honey? Yeah. Take your meds? Smoke cigarettes? No. You drink a lot, of honey. You're in that mid. You're you're the you're in the mid. You're in the mid thing, right? Yeah. You're gonna do a punch me, honey. You can't hit a woman, but you're a woman. What did you do this for, honey? You let a nice tooth go through on there, that for a little bit, honey. What? Hey, you got new shoes. Where'd you buy those things? Those things are ugly. Oh, my bad, honey. Honey, I didn't mean to say that, honey. I'm sorry. No smoking. No guns. No. Alcohol and new animals. Dude, for a joke, I should call and say, look. I keep seeing things run through by the camera. Yeah, she walked away.
Pretty to get for the I'd say, honey. What's this door do? What's this window look out to? Oh, you can actually park your mark. You can actually probably park my car right there. What's this horror look? Oh, the ambulance bay. We are pretty much good to go. Okay, well, well, that's doing it. Nurse Candy has used the restroom in her head. What kind of?
<laughs> We're just checking rooms to make sure nobody came in. Oh no. Reading Skybox. Ha 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 You know what people are thinking? You know what everybody's thinking right now? Is that Kirby West? Hell to the no. You know, what should we be? We are way dead.
Here we've been waiting. Nothing yet, nothing, nothing, You know what, we could probably do like a f three one one f fire alarm activation at pillbox. Um, they can go around and take all the pole stations. Actually, I want to see if there's actually pull stations in here. Before I do something like that, I want to see if there's a pull station. Well, that sucks. You can't do anything. Nobody wants to check this stuff out.
Come on, Brian, swallow something for me. Do, 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 That one's a close tout. So there, there's only these three chairs to sit here at. And someone chewed my my pencil. Doctor uh, Demo shit in there ate my pencil, so I had to get go get I had to go get a new one. Come on. Oh, I'm not liking how that gets going. Yeah, um, Angel's been keeping me busy. Angel's been keeping me busy so far. He's been sending me down, sending me uh, paramedics to stock the rigs. Yeah, we actually have a decent amount of sieves on. We have how many sieves we have on? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten sieves, which is not too bad. And then we gain what? Two more. Uh, six. Is that class still going on? Yeah, so we gain there two later in a couple minutes anyway. Well, whenever that class is done, so it's not too bad. Oh my god, so, so I'm looking at Skybox right now, and apparently someone's running around. A black African American with purple clothing and dreadlocks. Guess what? You know what? How much want to bet everybody in the server, other than the the ones that are doing the Civ stuff, everyone's pointing their fingers at Kirby right now. Bet you anything. Any any Leo guys right now are looking at this and saying that's that's uh, Kirby. I'm waiting for it. 
Man, she looks way more hotter with her hair tied up. Well, her be her booby her belly belly her belly start kind of clipping through. Here, let's just say it's going to be quiet for the next couple of days, a couple of hours. Have you seen this? Like, look how big this is. Like, look how big am I? Look how big a hospital I got. So you have this room with Doctor. Oh, well, this guy's now. Oh, there's Doctor Avery. How you doing? I thought you. I thought you left me with freaking Doctor. Uh, um, what's what, what's good with the what, what what's the bald guy's name? Um, Doctor Mister Clean, honey. Then we have our locker room. Locker room's nice. It's just not too bad. I have some stuff in there because you know that door's locked, so we can't go in that door. The, the rookie doc, the rookie firefighter, locked me out of my own uh, my own door, so that door over there is locked. So I might have to do a call so I can get that one unlocked. Then here, well, we all know where the bathrooms are. No kidding. Um, then we have OR1. OR1 is something like, you know, maybe like a cask or you need, got a plate, you need me to put a plate in type deal. I thought someone else was in here. And then you got OR2. OR2 where I can take bullets or anything that's like inside the body out. Maybe a tapeworm. That's just nasty. Tapeworms. And then you go on OR3. It's pretty much just, you know, I call this going to, I'm just going to call this OR the burn, burn and something to do like, you know, hazmat stuff come in here because it does have the hazardous bin right there. It has these red things, fill boxes. And you go down this aisle. Then we have a whole MRI machine for a CAT scan. That's kind of cool. I like that. My very own doctor's office. When we get more people, I can actually sit in here and RP as a doctor. Like, a, you know. Look at that. See, I have my own office type deal. Well, it's kind of cool. Like, I like to RP as a, you know. If I can do this full time as a full on doctor here, X ray, and then there's a couple of nice things back here. But like it's it's the view I like. See like you might back here and you can look out the back door and not the back door, back back window. And then that one, so this one is like if you, um, you got a whole family in an accident, they can share a room. And then this one is like if I'm going to do, so I think this one I'm going to do, this one's going to be a uh, surprise kind of RP in this one. So we're going to keep this one off limits for right now. But, you know, if we have, uh, end up having, um, some big testing done. We're gonna pretty much use that one for eight, for that one. But oh, wow, wait. It's not hurt. It's not hurt. Hurtful. Put the horn for a bit. <coughs> Could you imagine? Oh, 
Oh, dude, I have an idea. Oh my god. T slash three one one. Fire alarm. Upper pillbox. Let's get a little action around here, shall we? But if this works. So when we get drag, I'm going to tell them that the computer here is showing that we have an alarm system going, a fire alarm activation coming from the ambulance bay. And then what to, and then when they say, well, what do we find, what do we find, what T slash, you know, RP uh, alarm sensor downstairs in the ambulance bay is getting set off with mild temperatures rolling in. Which is true, like certain, so certain fire alarms will go off, like so like, if we get this house too warm, our fire alarm will go off. It's one of those heat treated ones, so. Let's see if they show up in the back or the front.
Do we actually? Oh, I was gonna say, do we actually lose two sibs already? Unless someone knows they're relogging. A little, you know, a little action for the fire. <laughs> Damn it. Hey little guys, how you doing? Lieutenant Chief Fortig from the front fire department. We got a alarm. Yeah, so the, the, the alarm system on the computer is saying there's an alarm system going off down in the basement. I guess it's the ambulance bay, honey. Ambulance bay. Okay, we're gonna have a look at it. Uh, who's this with me? I'm Brody, sir. All right, let's go down there. It, um, it looks like a sensor. It looks like a sensor that's going off. So it might be one. Yeah, it looks like a smoke detector thingy or whatever down there. All right. Okay. Uh, Do you want me to clear upper just to make sure? Uh, yeah. Go down. Go down to the bottom first. Make sure you 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 find that uh sensor. Okay. Uh, nurse. Um. Nurse candy, candy, honey. Candy. Okay. Uh, which computer is uh, attached to the alarm system? It's uh, both these two, honey. And if I go around? Yeah, you can come around, honey. And just, just make sure your uh, dude, your your officers don't lock all the doors, honey, because. We only have certain, we don't have really different keys and, you know, the, the, the mechanic guys are not here, homie. Honey. I got you. I got you. I got you. Uh, homie. All right, so we'll do T slash. i wait for him to respawn. Come on, let's see what Angel comes Let's see what Moon Demon. So that's Moon Demon in front of us. He's going to be checking over stuff. Stuff. Since they were, already, you know, they were only doing fire hydrants, so why not give them a call? You know what I mean? 
So we're going to work on, you know, kind of give them a call. I don't know, know what RP he's going to do. So I'm going to go RP. RP6 he's going to use. Okay. RP6 checks the computer for alarm system at. What do I see? What's triggering? So we're going to say four um, heat sense uh, sensors in ambulance bay is going off. There's in the ambulance bay is going off. Alarm. Right. Alarm is sounding in the bay. There's no battalion one, there's a battalion two. Go no signs, signs of smoke, but do see ambulance be doors. This fire panel in the previous garage going off. Uh, no signs of smoke, but uh, do, but do see ambulance bay doors open. Uh, so and two, two, squad two. Um, I got here in channel six uh, that the uh, the heat sensors down there in the ambulance bay are going off. Can you check that for me? Fire panel showing. The heat sensors on Challenge two to ambulance one. Make sure you come into the lower section. Uh, the top is uh, we're, we're having activity on the top side. Oh wait, that's RB two. There's, what is, so why is there two whoa. why is there two uh chats going on? Did you find the the you see did you find get find the problem, honey? Yeah, I just hit the reset. I'm gonna see if those sensors reset. It is. It might be because of the humidity in the air, honey. It's supposed to be like it's we're in we're kind of warm out there, honey. Oh yeah, you had you had a spider in your mouth, honey. Oh wait, T slash. John two squad one. Are you in need of an ambulance? Per six sensors. Reset. Uh, yeah, reset. Oh, all right.
Oops. I think one of my ambulances just came in with a patient. There's candy. Okay, honey. Um, uh, let me go ahead and get that. You're good here, right, honey? Yeah, I'm gonna do one more thing and then we're done. Hello, honey. I'm oh. sorry, honey. Hi, Nurse I'm Candy. Sorry. How you doing, honey? All right, so we got Kenneth Jones here. You want to repeat this for her? Hey, how's it going? So this is Kenneth Jones. Uh, he's part of one, v on one MVA. He has a possible concussion. His vitals are normal. Uh, he has a heart, high heart rate of 115. Uh, he has one gash on his head. We stuffed it and disinfected it. Other than that, it's all we should have for him. He seems to be doing pretty all right. He's, he's responsive, but he's not there fully. Okay, I'm gonna look at I'm gonna look at your paperwork. Hold on, hold one second, honey. Right. This will kind of help on both sides. Uh, do, 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 do. Let's do this one first. Let's go T slash E clip board. Okay, I'm just I'm just writing everything down, honey. So you said uh, Jones, right? She been the paper. Okay, and does he did um does you do you know if you have any allergies to anything, honey? I had not I didn't ask at all. Uh I, we were just kinda make sure he's getting all right. The bleeding was stuff. Mm -hmm. I forgot to ask. Okay, and did you guys administer any uh drugs on the way here, honey? No, no medications no. were administered. Um all we we just made sure that he was all right uh we patched up the head wound he wasn't complaining of any pain or anything uh, well he had neck pain we did give him a c collar but he w the pain wasn't significant enough to give him any medication so so honey is it just a gash on his head type deal yeah okay can i can i bore you guys for a second and can we move him to or2 please it's just the room next yes. door yes. please and thank you all right mr jones we're gonna have, him have you get up for a little bit we're gonna go over to the next room all right all right. Are you are you good? Do you need to get on stretcher? Or can you? Uh, I think I'll be fine. Yeah, this is the burn 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 area, honey. We're not you're not on fire today yet. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what's my day? I wouldn't be surprised if it happened. So Kenneth Jones, um, can you verify? Do you have any medical history or allergies? Uh, no, ma'am. Okay, and what's the, what's your age? Uh, uh, give me a minute on that one. Okay, um, thank you, gentlemen, very much. I will have oh, a report. Sorry. Oh, go ahead. Sorry, no, go ahead. No, go. No, uh, what else did you have on your report, honey? Oh no, that was it on the report. It was something on the side, but it's alright. Okay, honey, uh, just go, uh, one of you guys go to the front desk and just, uh, sign, uh, just sign off on it and you guys are good to go. Yay. You too. How, how was his vitals today, honey? Uh, his vitals? His vitals were all right. Uh, his they were normal, high. normal, uh, a little high heart rate. Any blood, blood loss, honey? Uh, just a little slow bleed. That was it from the gash on his head. Honey, are you feeling nauseated anytime, time, like that, or 
Are you feeling like really sick? Are you tired? Not really. I mean, I just kind of feel sore from like the, the hit, but other than that, I feel okay. All right, well, I'll check over your uh, your gash in a second. I'm gonna get these guys off so they can get back on the call. All right, um, you just wanna go to the front desk and then just sign off on that. That'd be good. Yep, I got you. Herpes. Six. Check software on the conversions. The software is up to. It is up to. It is up to date. Oh no, up to date. Okay, so. So we're looking at a gash. So we'll look for here. Um. Come up here. I'm gonna go like this. Copy. And I'll go like that. Let's go like this. And then I'll put my gloves back on. Okay. I'm gonna put my mask on. Me looks at the gosh on the head. Is it still bleeding? Oh, come on. So what were you doing today to get this big gash on your head, honey? Well, I was just driving my taxi for work, and then this stupid truck pulled out in front of me on the freeway and, like, totally just ran me off the road. All right, honey, this is going to sting, but I'm going to I'm gonna use a little peroxide here to clean up the wound on you. Uh, all right, I'm ready. And t -slash. Sanitize to clean wound. Ooh, ooh, yeah, that that's got a sting to it. Yeah, yeah. All right, just hold your head still. I'm gonna wrap it up with bandage. Okay, just there, just a little bit there like that. Okay. Now, I'm going to give you an, an aspirin. That's the, you know, because it, it is a gash on the head, so you might get a headache or whatnot. But with this aspirin, it will bring the headache away. All right. Um. There you go, honey. 
There you go, honey. Um, come on in, honey. I just wanted to let you know that he needs a BAC and he's on a hold. Oh, you need a blood sample? Yeah. Okay. And then we're waiting for Leo, right? Yes? Yes. Okay, so I'll bring, I'll, I'll do that and I'll send that to the lab. And then when they get here, I'll give them the results on that. All right. Awesome. I just wanted to let you know because I, uh, he didn't tell you. Okay, honey. All right. Bye, this kitty. Have a good one, honey. All right, I have some good news and bad news, honey. The good news is I'm going to get the headache away. The bad news is I got to have a sticky with a needle. So are you able to take your your sweater off, honey? Oh, uh, yeah. All right, so we're doing a blood draw. Where's my blood draw? All right, there you go. Uh... All right, honey, can you make a fist for me, honey? Like, like grip your hand, like grip your hand, gonna make a fist. Okay, because I'm gonna put this rubber band on you. Oops. Okay, I know this is gonna hurt, but bear with me, honey. All right, make it fast, please. One, two, three. Did you get an accident too, honey? Or is it just the trucker that hit you? It was just the guy who hit me. Well, my taxi crashed into a wall, but, you know. All right, good. Honey, I got, I'll take the band off now. One, two, three. Yeah, All right. Thank you. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and get you to move over to uh, recovery room. Uh, I, I'll take care of your your thing up there. Um, you're you're on a hold it in, until the the cops get here. I guess it's a you know I guess it's one of those things that if you crash or something hurt happens to your vehicle that someone has to come talk to you. But uh, I'll be back in in a few minutes to give you um, to check on that wound on you. All right. So am I staying here or am I going somewhere else? Um, you're just gonna go across the hall, honey. Alright. And just a verification that it, it's Kenneth Jones, right? Yes, ma'am. Okay, thank you. I'll be back. Alright, so we're gonna go over here. We're gonna use this place as um That's the lab. All right, so I'm gonna go like this. I'm gonna go. Me. T slash V. And then we're gonna go down here. Um. So this one right here, so it'd be yeah. No, so it'd be this. Oh, we're just gonna go like this. Um, Kenneth uh, Jones. has been have been just so on treating Ben Jones. 
Kenneth Jones, and then go back here again and just go like this. Copy. Jones will be ready for local sheriff to speak to him. There we go. Copy. Boom. T slash control V. Um, did I get a response on that one? Let's see if he gets that. How you doing, honey? How's your head? Uh, I'm good. Did you guys see the fluffy, uh, fluffy clouds today, honey? I, I don't think so. Because the sky is blue today, honey. Do you need a glass of water, honey? Oh, uh, yeah, that'd be great. I'm pretty thirsty. You might have to stand up if you, if you catch my drift, honey. All right. There you go, honey. Thank you. Thank you. So someone will be here to to, to pick you up. I think you know. I guess not really pick up. I guess to talk to you, honey. I'll be I'll be way up, I'll be up front waiting for them and. If you need anything, just hit the buzzer and I'll come and check on you. Alright, I'll be here. Uh, I wonder if Chief will take a, unlock my door for me. No! I'm gonna have to get them to unlock my door. I'm kinda locked in here now. Really, it stopped working. That was not bad, that was actually fun. What else RP Global? Gloves. So he said no negative to drugs and So yeah, he had only had a couple of stuff on him. Um, so now, I go back into my Discord.
because I have a thing all written out on my side. So I can do. This one, copy, put back in here. Kind of like this. I've been enjoying this a lot. It's, uh... Hey, Love Brisky, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Hope you're doing well. So I gotta give me my report too. But according to my thing. He hasn't done anything wrong. Um, but, like, we're going to have to eat and drink ourselves, so that's not too bad. Oh, hey, I want to see something. Pretty good. I've been working on more stuff for this character so we can um, actually really RP out like as a doctor type thing. Something new to SRP. Well, not, we're not really new, but old. We're going to check on him. Hey, Kenneth. Are you, um, how's your heart at the moment? Is it bleeding or is it, or do you need a little bandage on that one? Uh, I, I think it's good. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think we're good. Are you, are you okay? So you're not lipping on anything like that, honey? No, uh, not that I know of. I mean, I've just been laying here. Okay, and you're you're still good on your food there, honey? Uh, yeah, I'm good. Okay. Well, here's an Air 2A aspirin for you, honey. Alright, thanks. You should take up the pain, honey. All right. You remember, this buzzer for me. Sounds good. Oh, oh, yeah. We did him. We're working. Yeah. So right now we're working on Austin, two twenty. Um. We had a fire call. We did that one. We turned, you know, something different. Um. It's nice that Angel said they're gonna do a inspect the inspection on the vending machines due to the fire um it looks like this since jason's down with that
the best part of waking up is <laughs> playing around with dead bodies or some kind of body. Yeah, because I totally forgot we had bandages again, right? So. See, this one, you don't have. It doesn't kick you out of your seat. Got an air one for me? Yeah, they're in there. Uh... Hello, ma'am. How's it going, honey? So we uh we have her on our backboard here. Uh, she had two gunshot wounds. One was in the left shoulder. Uh, that's through and through. The other was a hip. Um, that one was not. Uh, vitals, real quick. She is uh, 79 heart rate, respiratory 10. Um, blood pressure is 160 oh. over 58, and her O2 is oh, at 94%. Jones is a taxi driver. Okay, honey, so you said two gunshot uh, GSWs, honey? Yes, one left shoulder, one on her hip. Damn for honey. She and... also got, I'm sorry, she also got bit in the leg by a dog. Uh, there is a tourniquet applied for that, and some, um, uh, packing in the wound, but uh, the bleeding has been controlled. Yes, yeah, I, I so see the, that. Uh, patient's name was Jessica Summers. Jessica Summers? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Can you fill out on the form there, honey? Oh, yep. Please and thank you. Okay, so what we could do with the foot, honey, we can, you know, we can, you know, sterilize it and then you know, you know, wrap it up. Now the GSWs, I will have to bring in her, her in the surgery, honey. So, um, that might be in, you know, a couple hours on that one. But I'll go ahead and get uh scrubbed up and you know do the GSWs on that, honey. All right. You have anything uh, further for us, man? Um, is the Leo coming for the the bullets on for the evidence, honey? Uh, yes, they're uh they're just outside the room. Okay, honey. All right, honey, I'm going to go scrap up. I got to give um, a blood sample to someone else. So give me two minutes. I'll Don't be back call in. Me honey, 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 I'm going to have to put you to sleep so I can do the surgery, honey. All right. No good there? Yep. Uh, form? Okay. Um, is she a criminal, honey? Uh, yes. Does she need handcuffs? She has she... soft restraints on now. Okay, honey. I'll, I'll bring, make sure we'll bring the officer in so we can keep an eye on all this stuff. Yeah. Okay. You give me about, five, about, about an hour or so, honey. Like, you give me five minutes or so, honey. How long you said? Or the front of these vehicles? Huh? Uh, a couple of minutes. I can give if okay. you want to stay, or you want me to give it to the other officer here. It's up to you, honey. I'll talk to him. See if. Uh... All right, I'm just gonna give him the blood sample thingy, and then uh, um, I'm gonna go ahead and do the surgery. All right. Um, that was my first ride of the day, so like no more than an hour. Good day, officer. How you doing? Um. Doing all right. How are you? And not too bad, honey. So we, um, with Kenneth Jones, we got his blood samples back. They came back negative for any drugs or alcohol in it. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome.
All right, honey, before I start to submit uh, the surgery, do you, are you allergic to anything? Like anything? No. Okay. All right, honey, so can I, I know well, it's just me in here because it's a woman. Um, can I get your shirt off so I can uh, get these bullets out of you? Please and thank you, honey. Sure. Thank you. Um, you no, know, you'll be in La La Land type thing. So you're gonna uh, kill me and then put me in Candyland? No, 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 I'll kill you, honey, and I'm gonna put you in a happy land for a couple hours. Okay. Think it, think like you're uh, you're high, honey, but you're sleeping. Oh, I'm already high. I'm a, I'm a okay and PCP. See you in a couple of minutes, honey. So now I'm giving them an option if they want to kill off their their character. Okay. So that's good. Oops, hit the wrong button. Yes or no. Damn it. No, okay, cool. He's getting it now, so that's awesome. Closes up wound. All right, so we'll go like this. Yeah. 
Alright, so while he's waking up. Oh, hello? Welcome back, honey. Where am I? You're at P.O. Box Medical. Well, how did I end up here? Um, we have a couple officers that will explain in a few minutes. Um, you're still kind of, um, restrained to the table for right now. Um. Why the hell am I restrained? Get me out of here! Doctors will explain, the, 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 the officer will explain that in a few minutes. So I'll be right back. Officer, what the hell did I do? I didn't do anything. He, he'll explain in a few minutes. Wait, give me one second. Officer. Yes, Katie, are you okay? Yes, um, you want to keep an eye on him while I um move this tray into the other room and uh, so I can bag the stuff for you guys? Yep, will do. You might yeah. want to calm down a little bit. Why am I in here? I don't remember what happened. Ah. We're going to move do this one. Oh, wait, no, wait, I'm doing that wrong in the wrong area. Um, where's that other one I had? Right here. Like that. There's candy. I think he needs to be released, your other patient there. Okay, give me a second, honey. Are you good to go, honey? Yeah, I was just going to check with you. Okay, um, if you have any more headaches in the, in the future, just come back. We'll give you, we'll give a check over there with headroom. But in the meantime, keep the headroom on and try not to get hit again, honey. I'll try. I got a long walk to the taxi company, though, so I better get started. All right, honey. Be safe this time. I'll try. Thanks so much. You're welcome, honey. me bags up two bullets up bullets into evidence and then I'm gonna go like this I think that's what he said, Jessica Summers, right? I gotta go up. So it's going to be this one. All right. Control V. It's for Jason. Oh, OR2. I keep forgetting it was OR2. 
Okay, honey, so the surgery was successful. Um, he still has everything. It, those two wounds kind of, you know, it, it, it's, it, it's, it's stitched up, honey, but um, it could be still open. But he's good to be transferred, honey. Okay. Um, the, just slip him over into the recovery room, and I'll, uh, I'll take her from there. All right, honey. So you can go ahead and uh, uncuff her from this table and bring her over to the across the hall, and then you guys can do your, what you're gonna need to do. Um, where is your where, where is your vehicle, honey? Uh, it's down on the uh, first level. Okay. Um, so just just let me know when you're ready to leave, honey. And I'll I'll help you bring uh, down the evidence box, and then you can just stick it in there while you put him in the back. Okay, sounds good. All right, thank you, honey. I'll be at the front desk. <sighs> Did I not say quiet or not? Oh, <laughs> two back-to-back -back calls. Be easier if they were to switch into their hospitals. Did he unlock this door for me too? Oh, damn it! Well, give me the one who's arresting me, damn it. Uh, well, he's not here right now. Uh, hey, honey, do you have a, do you have an extra key, honey? An extra key? Yeah, for for the hospital over there for Ward A. If you catch my drift. I I might. Let me get um. Where's it at? Where do I need to? Uh, oh, it's over here. Alright, stand right here and don't move. Uh, what if I do? There you go. Thank you, thank you, honey. You're bringing her down to the car here right now, honey? Yep. Okay, give me a second, let me run into the evidence room. Damn, he's quick. Which door is it? This one? You arrest this homeless motherfucker that's sitting right here. Go ahead and put it in there. Thank you. You're welcome, honey. Have a good one.
I gotta eat. I gotta eat when I get back up there. Busy. Hey, Flora. <sighs> Busy, isn't it? All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and go bring up my other thing up, so they're closer to the top when I come in, when I get in. So this one. What E clipboard? Tell, let me tell you one thing, Sano. Let me tell you one thing about me and a doctor. Never say quiet because fuck, it get crazy up here. No, I'm joking. I, I love it. Different. It's really, really, really different. Like, look, look how many things I have to type in today. Like, um. Um, where's my other thing I put? Oh, right there. So basically I've been... So I've been mostly been busy, busy, busy. Like I started off slow, but it's been picking up and pillbox. Yeah, so it's like it's. And then my trick was. I want to see if one angel comes in, or like Moon Demon comes in after patrol. I want to see him say that the, you know, the Echo One thing was actually kind of funny because they're beeping at him. Are we having a is a nerve patient coming in? I mean, there's a nerve patient coming in. It's like shit. Doctor Avery, do we have a nerve patient coming in? Make sure there's nobody in my ORs first. Clear.
but it's nice. I th thank you, Jace, uh, Gamer J, for reopening my door since somebody locked my door on me. But. Is everything okay, honey? wrong way, but it's fine. Oh, you went the wrong way. Oh, I got you, honey. Yep. You better want to cover up just in case of those pervers are out there. Well, I, 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 I'm leaving, you know, for the night, even if you don't know I me. Mean. Oh, okay. Have a good one, honey. Thank you. But wait, do I look hot like this? Eh, hey, you got bigger tits than I do, honey. Ooh, that's great. <laughs> oh, shit. It's kind of fun. It was kind of fun. So, 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 so far we had was it three or four. Yeah, we have three or four patients so far. And then we had a fire call, and then we had um, a restock order call for the fire department. We've been going good. But we're mostly been rocking this out. As I see it, like, you know, yeah, I'm working mechanic type deal, but I'm also, you know, trying to be the full on. So the, my plan is to be like a full on doctor for SRP and, you know, um, like, you know, when is it, you know, the, I've seen something. Hold on. Stand by. Let's go check. Windows. Run, 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 lady. Run. Just gotta see if somebody's coming in. No lights there. I don't see no lights. You know, it's just, it's just so awesome that you can look, look down. Yeah, 
kill this again. Uh, ward A, go back this way, main hall. Man, I should do reports of If you're not fighting ghosts, you're fighting doctor. Dude, I actually almost had to call for it. Almost. Where did the magical backpack come from? Backpack, backpack. Backpack, backpack. Everybody love backpack. We got something downstairs. Is the light just still on? Come on, let me in the door. I'm not getting light, so... So we're just waiting on more patients to show up or more stuff for from the EMS to bring in like so far so yeah so we had a couple of good calls not too bad nothing more than the egg I can take
So yeah, we were waiting for more people to come in. We had, so we had one with Jason. That was kind of cool. Actually, no, two with Jason actually, to be honest, because um, uh, Gamer J, some people know him as. I think yeah, we had two calls with him. Um, <coughs> his first one was a crash victim, which he had a gash on his head. A little bleeding, not too bad. Um, we were able to bandage up his head and give him some aspirin for the headache. And then... Um, and then I think Sergeant Benjamin brought in a uh, gunshot victim. Well, well, EMS brought him in, but, you know... Um, so I think I don't. I think if I'm not mistaken, I think it was Mike and I can't remember his partner's name, but they brought in yeah a gunshot victim with two GSWs, one to the shoulder and one to the waist. Um, he ended up getting moved over the tra uh, transport over to uh, intensive care, and from there um, he was able to get transferred to. Um, Bolingbrook, and then the medical doctors there will take over for Leia, keep an eye on those two wounds. Um, and then we had a fire call, which, you know, it was kind of like a muggy day type deal. We had um, the ambulance play, a lot of uh, heat sensors going off. Which sometimes you know it can happen with the heat with the heat and all that with the humidity. So with that being said, with that went off. We have sky life. Do do we have sky life? Sky life coming in. That was her helicopter. Oh my god, if Skylife come in. We actually have Skylife dropping in. You know what? I think what I should do is at the end of patrol, I'm gonna spawn up to near um, the RP shop, and I'm gonna get her more some some more stuff for the doctors, you know, for the hospital. So maybe like a doctor's, you know, a phone number for the, you know, the fire chiefs, you know, the, you know, the ones, you know, the chief, the COC guys, so they can call in if if Sky Life is coming in, I can go ahead and get stuff treated, get some stuff ready for. Did they actually move him already? See if it's just the one per per patient coming in. I know it's Sky Life. Who we got? I know Skylock just landed. I heard it.
Too bad we don't have a ding. A ding sound. Ding. You know, like how the door opens to a ding sing for the elevator. Do 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 wa 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 I gotta see that all good girl. I let a good girl.
You know, she said slouch. Wah 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 wah. Sweet. So looking at a skybox, I see Ben found something that might has a pill bottle. So we're just waiting, I know. Keep hearing Skybox? Not Skybox. Oh, the best part of this thing here is that anybody comes in that way. Am I too far? I'm afraid to call something in because if we call something in then
It's too quiet. It's like nobody dying tonight. Sometimes people just like poof. Bye bye. Uh, who are you? What happened to Doctor Avery? You look like look like a monkey man. Doctor Ape, that's your new name. Yeah, okay, your new name is Doctor Ape. You look like, like a gorilla. Yeah, you look like a big gorilla. Okay, honey, you look like a gorilla ape. Doctor Ape gorilla. Ooh. Why does it look like I've been carrying a gun? <laughs> Time to blow up chat again, shall we? Oh wait, um, I want to wait till Benjamin gets his answer and then put it up. So like Ken said yes. Anybody in here? I just want to double check every I'm checking my rooms. So when Sergeant Ben gets his uh Answer from Brian. I'll put my ad up again Because I really want to do some really good RP in here And Last couple of times it's been really good like So I'm gonna not pay attention to sky bye.
Is he, are you serious? <laughs> We've already did a 24 hour shift. Almost. 12 hour shift. We can do like a 911. You know what? If we're not getting any more medical ones, we can probably call out 311 and, and say. We can do like 3 slash 11. Locals. Local residents report of. Um, local residents report of car. See, I wish way too crazy. Do you want to get your nuts cut off? Let me know. We got big scissors for that, homie. <laughs> oh, waste your head a real loud. The skybox coming, sky, sky, sky life, or whatever it's called, coming in for our landing. It sounds like it's so real when you get to hear. I think John and Brian are about to try to do something. How are you doing? Whoosh. Come on down for a prostate cancer checkup. Do you want a prosecute team or whatever? Very much. Die, bitch. Don't tell me to die, bitch. Don't throw me like that. I'll, I'll give you a needle and put you sleepy. Bye bye bye. Bye bye bye. We could probably put in our 911 call for that same alarm. Actually, no, because no, technically the it'd be nice and cool now again. Um, I 
maybe a fire call for uh um Like I've been enjoying it, so I love doing this. Like, you know, we drink a lot out here. Keeping an eye on the. Yeah, I know how the p. I like. I know how the pyramids like to sneak up behind me now. But like tonight, best night ever. Yeah. Even though we had to call the fire department to do that, just to like bump up the RP a little bit, but that was, you know, you do get like those calls, like, you know, um, you know, sensors are like overheating or something like that, or like, you know, you leave a garage door open and the heat sensors go off, you know, it happens. So, you know, that was trying to bring some little realism to it. And then to start it off, you know, Ortego, or Chief Ortego sent uh, some guys down to get a, a supply pickup. That was kind of cool. You know, we sent the rookie over here, go in here into the supply closet to get him his stuff, and then we brought Mike back there to get the good stuff. But on the way out, he ended up locking this door. Which, you know, if you lock that door, then lock that door and lock that door, the box is on, yeah, it's useless. And then when the other call came in, I forgot to try to get uh, Angel to go back over there and unlock that door for me, but I got caught up, I had two calls back to back. Well, two patients back to back. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, but two, three, four, lift, 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 right, lift, 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 right, lift. Lift. So we still have a couple of fire and EMS on. That's not too bad.
do 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 you know what this is a good time for? Yes. Let's put an ad up there. Hide all those exit exit ones. Those exiting people. Exiting and joining. Exiting and joining. Let's just put an ad up there to cover all the ads. Stuff up. It's a live in the collection. I wanna rock. Do 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 do. Do 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 So I want to be more prepared like so when I see them walk in I can walk up to them and say okay so what kind of patient do you have here? How's it going, honey? Hi, how are you? Not too bad, honey. Uh, so I may have been brazened by a coyote. Um, oh, you know you're gonna I mean? you're gonna get rabies, shot, honey. Yeah, that's what I'm that's what I'm here for. I've already been treated for the wound. Now I just need to need to get a rabies shot. Better safe than sorry, right? Yes, honey, that's right, honey. Okay. Uh, do do you want me to just wait out here, or are you just are you ready for it? Um, let me go get my, uh, let me go scrub up and then I'll come in there and, uh, I'm going to have to get you to take off your hair, honey. Oh, okay. I got it. But you can, you can leave the vest on, honey. It's up to you. Um, I got to, do you have any allergies by any chance? Uh, no, I do not. Okay. So can I give you, I'm going to give you this clipboard here, honey. I just need you to fill it out as best you can. And then I'll be in there and, uh, we'll get you a uh, rabies shot. Okay. There you go, honey. All right. And name is officer. Uh, Deputy Gibson, Jeffrey Gibson. Jeffrey Gibson. All right, Doctor Gibson. Uh, Doctor uh, Avery, how you doing? So we have uh, Deputy Gibson out there. He got bit by uh, a coyote. Um, we're gonna miss her a, a rabies shot and and maybe an aspirin just to keep the pain away, just in case there's any pain. And we'll treat it and see what we have on it. Okay. Sounds good, honey. Thank you, Dr. Avery. You do you, you do the best job, honey. Thank you. And then we got to put our stuff back on because we're dealing with somebody who has rabies. Got gloves, mask. All filled out, honey. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Oh, thank you. Thank We're gonna bring you back to one of the rooms, honey. Private, or you want to be you want to be open or private? Or be, well, I guess you have to get the gun duty. You have a boat duty at boat, honey. We'll bring you in a private room. Okay. As you patrol, honey. It was a bit, has it been good? good? Say that again? How's your patrol going, honey? Is it been good other than the, the dog bit you? Uh, it's a bit busy. Oh, sorry about that, honey. Okay. Alright, just put your gun bill and, and your stuff on that chair. 
and then have a seat on the chair on the bed there. Well, yeah, you yeah, but you got to take off your all your stuff off first. Not, not. Yeah. Okay. There you go. Um, looking at the medical medical form here. Um, can you state your name, date of birth? Uh, Jeffrey Gibson, six twenty-five eighty-one. Okay, so we're going to give him. We're going to be giving him. Uh, where's the needle on? Where's the needles? Okay, so. X. He slash me or see sanitize. Where is it? No. Slash me gets. Sanitizer swab. Let's see. Let's see your hand for a second, honey. It was your it was your hand, right, honey? Uh, I was. Yes. All right. Let's um, see. Ooh, he he got uh, you really good, honey. Yeah, he did. Would you like stitches, honey, or do you just want to wrap it up? Oh and... no, no, it's the the wound is already wrapped and taken care of. I just I just need the rabies shot. That's what I'm here for. Okay. All right. Would you like your left arm, left arm, honey, or you want your right arm? Left arm. Left arm. Oh, Mr. Butcher's in the way, honey. Okay. Uh, Ravy shot needle puts right mount of dosage. All right, sir. I'm gonna get you. Look at the window. Look, look at the stars, okay, honey? Look at like, it's a beautiful night on the city, eh? Yep, it is. It's a beautiful night out there. One, three, three. Ow! Sheesh. Oh. Well, that's why I said look at the, at the window. It's supposed to distract you, honey. I thought rabies shots are supposed to go in the butt cheek. Oh, maybe it is in the arm now, too. Hmm. Do I get a, a sucker or a sticker or something? Um, well, we don't really have suckers, honey. <laughs> we, we, we give this to the little cute children, honey. Okay, yeah, save it for them. But we, we do have a, a share of the angel sticker, honey. Oh, thank you. I've got enough of those, okay, believe me. Do, do you want a, a band-aid, honey, or do you just want me to swab, uh, put a swab and tape over it? Uh, just a swab and tape, it's fine.
Ha. Tape. Oh, it's going to be sore, isn't it? Yes, honey, it's going to be a little sore for a bit. But you're good to put your your stuff back on. And then just come meet me by the front desk, and then I'll, I'll sign your doctor's note. Okay. Now, no funny business, honey. Oh, do 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 do. Oh wait, I forgot my I forgot my clipboard. Sorry, I forgot my clipboard, honey. It's okay. It's a beautiful night. <laughs> it's an awesome night. I just come right up to the desk, honey. One set, one minute. Rights Doctors Oh my god. <sighs> DOC, right? Yeah, doctor's note for baby shot for hips and He can pick up oh, pick up me writes a doctor snow for gifts or a rabies shot for gifts saying he gives he can pick up can Pick up aspirin at any local pharmacy, and it'll be. I'm just gonna go purin. Nope, wrong one. Nope, idea. Well, the, well, the eye has to go over the right uh, over here. There you go. There you go, sir. Here's a doctor's note, and, 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 and that on there, those also gives you um, a prescription for aspirin, just in case uh, you know the bike gets you a headache later on. Awesome. Thank you so much. You've been very helpful. You're very welcome, honey. You take care. You have a good night. You have a good night too, honey. Thank you. It was so that right there is Jeff figure Jeff figure Jeffrey Gamer. So let's get a let's get let's get a oh no oh. no.
Let's get a uh, redeem Jeffrey in here for Jeffrey Gamer. Redeem. GG. You know what really grinds my gears? You're not subscribed to Jeffrey Gamer. That's what's up. You know what grinds my gears? You're not subscribed to Jeffrey Gamer. That's been pretty good. I wonder if my thing will work now. Wait, let's see. Did it still work from the distance I was at? Oh, you know what? T slash three. Locals. Dog, a dog. Whining. Front. Of. Upper. Pillbox. You were moved. User joined your channel. Sheriff's office. Hi, I'm I'm one of the local residents that live around a uh, PO box here. I keep hearing a dog wanting a friend of PO box. Okay, uh, what's the exact address? Um, eight eight zero four zero, honey. Okay, and you said you hear a dog whining out in front of pillbox. Yeah, it, it, I, I'm trying to sleep, honey. It keeps I keep hearing whining, honey. Okay, all right. Is the dog in a vehicle or outside the vehicle? Can you it's see? Hard. No, no, I can't see with all these buildings in the way, honey. Okay. Right. And you're a local caller or are you on scene? Local caller, honey. Okay. All right. Well, we'll go and get someone out there to uh, take a look. Okay? Thank you, honey. It sounds like it's coming from the upper part. Okay. All right. So sounds good. We'll get that information out. Thank you, honey. Thank you. You were moved. This is going to be awesome. So, because it almost sounds like a dog whining from a distance. Yeah. Because it sounds like...
Oh, 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 oh. A lot of... So yeah, well, uh, a little um, ghostly thing. It is the Echo, echo One, so... Nurse? Yes, honey. Is that your possessed vehicle out front? What do you mean, honey? I, I, I pulled you over earlier in the night. I, I just happened to recognize it. Isn't that your white, uh, like, ambulance vehicle out front? It's not an ambulance, honey. It, it, it's, uh, it, it's my Cadillac, honey. Okay. Well, it's yours, though, right? Yes, honey. What's going on? Well, all the doors are going haywire and... Uh... Trunk is open and closing, and there's like glass flying everywhere. I just figured you should know, sir. Sir, I hate to ask you anything, but have you been drinking it lately? I promise you, I have not. My, I already called for a priest. And we have none available, so I'm, I'm at a loss to be honest with you. So, so you said this thing's going off, honey? I got I, I can't be staying long because I know, um, I think there's an ambulance just rolled up in here. There is, um, to be honest with you, I mean, it's not like it's a criminal thing, and if it is a ghost, there's really nothing I can do about it. As long as you're fine with it, then I don't, I, I don't know what yeah. else to do for you. Honey, to be honest, I haven't seen the ghost here. It's been, I, you know, it's been quiet here all night, and I haven't seen anything. All right. All right, well, if something changes, someone gets hurt or something like that, give us another call. Like I said, there's really not much I can do. Okay, honey. Well, I I, yeah, I I love to stand and talk, but you know the ambulance just rode up, and I had to get ready for treatments. I absolutely understand. Thank you, honey. Thank you. And it just if there is a ghost out there, honey, just just run, honey. Just I I, I don't know how you want to fight a ghost. I can't, to be honest with you. I, there's I it's not in our training. Okay, honey. So. Good luck to you. You too, honey. Okay. Oh yeah, I know I gotta eat. I know I gotta eat. I have an idea for somebody if... Slash E. Oh yeah, we I totally forgot that we were we just finished working on Jeffrey. E clipboard. And then right, I got ready because we have we have somebody coming in. Um. Oh yeah, I gotta eat. Was it back or front?
Really? He must hit his E button. Shit. Shoot. Is there even an ambulance here, or no? Or am I looking like... Or am I looking like King Tut trying to find a patient? I don't know. Well, see, Sean accidentally locked my door again. Well, not again. Let me go check downstairs. Uh, bottom level. Uh, reception area. Yeah. Oh, it must have been a false call. So it'd be kind of cool if you had two reception, like, so, you know, the plan is, like, if I can get other, um, you know, John on board to RP as another doctor, I can have one downstairs, I can have one person downstairs or two people, like, one upstairs and one downstairs type deal you know a patient comes in and he'll get him all set up while I type everything out um, everything is pretty much pre-typed out you know what I mean so it's just it's easy so like um, so if my let's see my open office is not gonna work then I'll switch straight to um, uh, what's it called I'll go ahead and switch to um, Discord and get my Discord stuff to do my T-Slash stuff. Um, so I'm waiting to so I'm waiting to get this one done. I want to do the cast one, but the other one I really want to do so bad, and I can't wait to do it. Um, is this I want to run the, I want to do the MRI thing so like I really want to try you know do the RP with the an MRI any you want an MRI <laughs> um well, kind of, well, kind of, but like, that means what I mean, I would have to lose my sieve stuff, I would have to go fire, and be like in the EMS, 
on collar type deal where I'm more or less an EMS I think but don't you know get me wrong I've been having really fun with this like um, you know how many calls do we have so far we had angels No, there's two angels ones we did, moon demons. So we had restock, we had the um, heat sensor one, then we had the two calls from Jason. Well, not well, the one wasn't really Jason's call, but it was uh, who was it? Was it Benjamin's? Yeah, Benjamin's call that turned into Jason's call. Well, he was collecting the evidence and just dropping off the patient, uh, the prisoner, and then the other call was um. What was the other call? Oh yeah, Jeffrey came, Jeff came in for a rabies shot, and then we turned this. We turned. We called the cop. We you know did a slash three one one of a haunted vehicle going off and crazy. And I think we're still going strong. Oops, I hit the wrong button. You know what, let's go ahead and press that button anyways. Uh, do, 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 do. I'm going to bring that up anyway so I don't lose it. Um, I want to see how many people we still have left. So we're still sitting at one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Sibs. And like we've been trying to go try and go good on it. Um you know that's awesome. Like you know, with Jeffrey coming in doing that, we were able to bring him back to the private room and we were able to do a private one because of the fact that, you know, He's a cop, he has a gun belt, so he would have to go into our private room anyways. So we took his, we got him to take off his gun belt, his vest and shirt. And then we administered the uh, rabies shot and then he was on his way. Like I understand, yeah, I took a chance on this patrol to give it a shot, and they're a whole full patrol and that. But Majoring him rode in the fight three six five three six five I fire life. Come on. Anybody want to come mess with the Echo One? It, it weird, so I do.
Yeah, I know. But see, what I'm trying to do too is I'm trying to make, um, I'm trying to change what other people can think of as civs. You know, like Brian, well, like way Brian and Mark and everyone else has been working hard to try to do. You know, there's so much uh, emotes, there's so much stuff you can do. Um, I did hear police sirens, I'm just trying to figure out. Do we have an area? I know right now Brian and John are planning on doing a Oh no no yeah I understand that. Um I think once if I keep putting the effort I put in um on patrols and work keep working hard, um eventually I can just move up to eventually I can move up to COC, which you know COC will be able to unlock those doors. Anyways, I think it's a you know COC because I think COC yeah you can unlock those doors and lock them back up just like how DV DV is. So, like, I'm not too worried about it. As long as I still have a door to get into the back part, you know, I still can just RP it out that, you know, the alarm, you know, my key cards defunction type deal and call it out as, um, I went to swipe my card, swipe my card and it stopped working type deal, which they'll bring out like a, someone to investigate type deal. You can RP it out. It looks like I'm carrying a rifle. Hut two three, hut two three, hut two three, four. But it is a good idea, you know. I'm not gonna. Yeah, right? <laughs> My own medical card. Because like I am kind of like a re reserve FD, I still have to go through the training to get it all done. Um, but, but by me doing this type stuff will kind of help me get where I need to be for practice with the medical stuff. Like Moon Demon, uh, Moon, uh, Moon Demon was able, to, was nice enough to send me some bandages down. Um, the other thing I did request. Um, hoping it goes through in the next couple of days for a patrol is a med bag that I can carry around myself and probably not because it's more like an EMS thing but as a doctor it'd be kind of cool like manage some stuff we had we had a good patrol like we had about six calls Seven calls, well, six or seven calls, three patients. And I'm still not going to give up because I know there might be another call coming in. Because I'm looking at the dirt sheets, telephone, and yeah.
I might have something for the. I might, might, might be able to do something, get something kind of cool. Yeah, how's it going? Heavy, heavy foot, going, you man? know. Got another one for you. I was going to aim you when I wrecked. No. Um. What, what, what's it, what's his... Being, um, some bleeding from the neck area and arm. Nothing too major, but he's still bleeding. Okay, we can probably put him in OR1. Alright. You want some of that? Baba Jones, okay. D uh, do you guys know if he has any um, allergies or anything to medical? Uh, I do not. Alright, there you go. Okay. Oh. Finicky doors. So OR would be the last, those last two big double doors at the end. Yeah. So you guys are just saying, honey, a um, couple cuts, cuts and bruises type deal? Uh, yes, and he might have uh, possible trauma. I mean, he's gonna have MBA, so. I'm gonna send you down here, Mr. Jones. We'll be unstrapped. You can get yeah, out, right? I was in the MBA. Oh, oh MBA? Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Um, are you guys busy at the moment, honey? Uh, am I gonna get up? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, We're gonna turn the back for him. Alright. Do you guys want to carry him to the, or do you guys want to move him to the uh, MRI machine? Sure, we'll, where's that at? All right. Um, if one of you guys want to bring the machine, uh, the backboard thingy over with me, just follow me. We're, we'll go ahead and get him to check on the MRI machine. See if he has any external injuries. Okay, you can. Hey, hey guy, what's your name? It's Nurse Candy, honey. Okay, you I'm guys can you can you can drop him off right oh, here. My name is. My name is Hayden. Hayden, okay. Hey, all right, I'm gonna get you on this back where are you already uh, unstrapped? Uh, so if um, mother yep. empty guy, uh, yep. Hayden, yep. gonna pick it. One, two. All right, so we've been here. Okay, we're just gonna we're just gonna run a t we're just gonna do a run a test and we'll just see what what happens. It's not wait. Uh, it's better than I can't reach it. Um, excuse me. <laughs> oh, there we go. Oh, what the? Uh, <laughs> I guess that works. Okay, before we run Sometimes. the ma before we run the machine, do you have anything that's gonna be magnetic or metal? Um, I have my phone, my wallet, um, uh, keys, my uh, uh, that's it. Um, you want me to put them down? Just put, we're just gonna put a safe box muscle type deal, honey. Yeah, okay. Hey you guys, we'll do, we'll do it some tests and see what we have. Thank you, honey. Hello, Fireman Dan. How you doing? Okay, Bubba Jones, are you able to walk a little bit? Yeah, I am. Okay, we're going to bring you back to um, OR1 again.
sorry about it. sorry about the moving all of that. We just want to make we just want to make sure you're not bleeding in on the inside type deal, honey. Ah, uh, yeah, I was in a pretty severe accident. Was it just you, honey, or is there more people? Just me in the rollover once again. You said oh, I want yes, this right one right here. Yep. All right. So you just have cuts and bruises, honey? Yeah, and I feel like my head might be a little banged up, you know, from hitting the uh, cage on the car. Okay, one second, honey. All right, we're gonna look for. Where's my other thing? Uh, I'm looking. Let's see here. Let's see. Hmm. So I like doing this way, so the patient has, so the person that's RPing can know what I'm talking about. All right, honey, we're we're seeing a couple blue, dark, dark blue bruises. Not too bad. Scratches. Um, I can probably give you some aspirin after. Um, I'm just gonna check your just your 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 blood. You know, I'm gonna put a cuff on your arm and we're gonna pump it up and see if you know how your blood pressure is. Oh. Uh, do 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 do. And then last thing before we do anything, where was the other one I seen? One twenty over eighty normal. Okay. One last thing, honey. Can I can I get you to take off your shirt just a quick second, honey? Yes, ma'am. So the last thing I'm just going to do before we uh, move you over to the recovery room, I'm going to listen on your heart, on your lungs, honey. Uh, listen to your chest, and we're going to listen to your back part. Join is big time. Are you still you're still alive, honey? Yeah, I'm just doing something. Okay. Now, do you know if in, if the if the officers are coming to get uh ch talk to you, honey, or not? I just gotta put yeah, her. Okay, so I'll, I'll let them know when you're they're ready. Come get you, honey. So what was it, Bubba Jones? Bubba Jones? Where's Bubba Jones? 
Bubba Jones, I think was. I just had just a question, honey. It's Bubba Jones, right, honey? Okay, honey. Uh, we're just waiting for him to reply in Skybox. Once he replies in Skybox, then we'll go ahead and get him moved over. Uh, let's go like this. So you know that we have him. Okay, honey. So from the crash, I'm noticing a couple bruises, and then with your chest being a little raspy, um, I'm gonna feel around on your chest, on your like your stomach and that, and see if you're if you have any broken ribs. Okay, honey. Is let uh, me know. Uh, 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 how is this supposed to sound? I don't know. So raspy is like if you're if you're like um. Is it like about well, normal, honey? Or raspy is like if you're a smoker. You you, you smoker, honey? Oh, oh uh, uh, I think it might. I guess it's slow, most of me. You slow a little bit. I don't. I don't. I don't know. Well, like, well the, well, the slow kind of you know, it's, it's about the same because but the thing is, is, yeah, you've been interacting. Okay, so your heart's kind of yeah, okay. Your lungs are doing good. Just a little, a little slow, just because you know from the impact. I understand that, honey. So um. All right, I'm just gonna give you a little. I'm gonna put some bandages around you, on on around your chest okay. to keep up the bruises. And then um, I'll move you over the recovery and I'll put the thing up for you, for the for the officers, honey. Okay. All right, honey, this is going to be a little sore, but I'm just going to just still tidy it a little bit more. There, there you go. All right, honey, when you're ready, you can move over to the recovery room. I'll have the paperwork ready for the officers, honey. Right. You, would you like anything else, honey, like a drink, water? No, man. Okay. Just buzz if you need me, honey. All right, so we have. Oh, I just want to check my two OR rooms just in case no one else came in. What the hell was that? Oh, never mind. Man, nobody in that one. All right, so Logan. Is, well, Logan's still in thing, but he, I I know he's busy on Sky end up in Skybox. No. Oh. How's it going, honey? Huh? Where do you know where the Bubba Jones guy is? Oh, this way, honey. So he has a couple of bruises to his chest and arms. Um, I did run him through the uh, MRI thing. Um, no internal injuries, honey. Um, but he's good to go for you, to your guys' custody. Okay. Sweet. What room's he in? Um, I I think he's still in OR one, but he's supposed to be moved over to uh, um, recovery. Okay.
Yeah, he's in here. He's in the, right here. Yeah, he's in the OR one. You're good to go in, honey. Oh, he's in this one? OR one, yes. Less, okay, less, less trauma. Too much honey? I know. Why you want, well, you want honey with your, your coffee and tea? Oh. I know, I'm gonna get a voice changer soon. I know. Now here's the hard part for Logan. He has to talk to Richard and he has to talk to Webster. <laughs> oh, hate to be in those shoes. Oh, that's right. I was in those shoes before. Do, 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 do. Want to see something cool, Dan? Want to see something cool, Dan? I'll show you something cool. Check this out. Check this out. Want to hear something funny? Give this one. She's like, you got anything planned? You want? Do you someone want to take the Echo One for a run? Hey, wake up. I think we're about to wrap it up anyways. Bet you anything to get here in the hospital room. Really? You don't hear anything? Here, let me get closer to... Wait, let me get over here. Don't, don't mind Dr. Avery. Doctor Avery, you're bad. The last time I broke, the last time I broke it, I I was using something else.
<laughs> I think I'm gonna fix it before for end of patrol. I'm just gonna repair it since we're gonna be ending patrol soon anyway, so I need something to run back. Would it work? If I send a distance, would it work? But does still work. I can hide in the area, make it look like I'm. Should we call it in again? Local caller, local number, local. Locals keep calling in a local call caller calls in a haunted car. Actually, yeah, that's that's how we're gonna finish it off. T slash three one one four of a haunted car outside pillbox going crazy Now if I can stand at a distance where they're not going to see me, where I can still mess with the car, it might make it look good. Like I think Sean caught on to it. I don't think he caught, really caught on to it, but it was kind of funny because I was like able to go like this with the, because it's Echo 1 everybody, you know, Ghostbusters type 1 type thing. And it's sitting in front of a hospital. Hell yeah. What what's a way to finish off patrol, a dead patrol with a bang? You know, wasn't I mean, we're not killing anybody. We're not hurting anybody. Yeah, we're not killing. We're not hurting anybody. We're we're saving people. We're saving people's joy. You were moved. Nine one one. What's your emergency? I'm sorry, honey. I hate to call you back. It, it, I'm that local JSC upstairs from that one apartment. Heck, damn car. It, I think it's a car going off, honey. It just won't shut up. You know. It's, what do you mean a what What do you mean a car going off? It's three o'clock in the morning, and it's. I can hear this car going off in in front of pillbox, honey. Okay, but what is going off mean? Is the engine running? Is the horn honking? Lights are flashing, horns are going off. It's like, it's weird, honey. Okay. Okay. All right. And still a local caller. Still a local caller. I'm sorry to call you, honey. It's 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 this dead night. We're all we're trying to get rep for work and that, you know. Yep. I understand. Okay. Well, we'll get someone out there. Thank you, honey. Uh, can you give me a description of the car real quick? It's like an old Cadillac. Okay, old Cadillac. Very old. Oh, okay, perfect. All right, you got a color? It's like a, it's an old, old school ambulance, honey. Okay, gotcha. So white in color. White in color. Okay, thank you.
you were moved. Hey, what's up, Mama? Hey, how's it going, honey? Is that My damn, you? damn dog bit me. My damn dog bit you, honey. Yeah, I feel like a pork chop. Uh, hey, there that dude. Hey, get my stuff back, man. Where do you want me to take him? Um, what kind of injuries does he have, honey? Uh, I got just, like 10 holes in my damn leg. The holes from the uh, dog's teeth, no broken bones. Uh, bleeding has been contained with uh, uh, gauze. Uh, so, bleeding's contained. Um, beyond that... Uh, uh, we, can, we can go ahead and put him in OR1, honey. Oh, you gonna give me some pain medicines? What's up, Mama? Now we're gonna take a look at that wound, honey. Probably just limp over that table. Ready to pick him up? Yep. Over here, honey. Two, three. There we go. Oh, damn, that leg. Oh, it. Shit, it hurts worse when I'm standing up. Gently onto the table now. One, two, three. There we go. Ooh, that better. That better. Okay, what's the name on the medical field, honey? Uh, what's, my, what's name, my, my name what's, is Dalen. His is uh, Winston Williams. Winston Williams. Yeah, just, yeah, put it on the put it on the form. Okay. Now, is there going to be anybody waiting for him after? No, mom. I'm homeless. Uh, Ellis. Uh, sorry, the deputies. Uh, I think had some questions for him. They wanted them held. Okay, honey. So I'm gonna go get scrubbed up, and then I'll come back, and we'll go take out the wounds. Um, All right, mama. Where Where's the bite, honey? I'm out, I'm out, lower left leg. You know what uh, do bone be down there? I hate yeah. to, I hate this, I, I hate to ask this, honey, but can you guys help him take his pants off? Oh, Lord, here we go again with the pants off. Yeah, we can do that. And just, just sit tight, honey. Okay, right, we gotta figure... Is everything okay, honey? Hello? Hey, where are you going, honey? Honey? Honey, where are you running for? Where are you going, honey? I'm taking off. Oh, you're running away. Oh, okay. Um, If you're going downstairs, the, 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 the elevator's to the right, honey. Oh, okay. Thank you so much. Is everything I'm okay? Doing great, by the way. Why is it? Uh, yeah, yeah, we were here with the uh, the homeless guy there that with the dog bite. Oh, what's everybody getting dog bit around here? Well, that's a lot of bad guys. Oh, was one of you guys dogs bite him? Yeah. Oh, shoot. Yeah, he was a bad guy. So. What, what, was it your puppy hit bite, bite him, honey? No, it was a full-grown shepherd. Oh, hell, he gonna need Jesus now, honey. Yeah, he is. <laughs> is, uh, is there another officer back there with him? Um, let me go double check on it, honey. Okay. Is everything okay, honey? Oh my god, it's just like, it's like a war zone back here. You almost ready, honey? Holy jeepers here. They, those, they, those, those, legs, those legs are hairy hell. Oh, they, they, yeah, that. Well, I, like, I don't shave my nothing, but. 
Okay, sit tight, honey. I gotta go find somebody to stand outside, and then um, we'll, we'll get everything going, honey. Sorry. It's a, it's right, a. Mama, you, hey, 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 girl, you take your time. You take your time. I'm good right here. It's it's like a zoo in here, honey. There there's people seeing things and everything, and all. Oh, it's like crazy. Holy shit! You just jumped up on me. Are you okay, doing, honey? Good. Uh, when will he be ready to go? I'm gonna transport him. Um, I gotta I, I gotta take care of those dog bites. Would you be able? Would you be able to sit, have a seat there, honey, while I clean up his wounds and and then patch him up, and you'd be good to go. Yep, that's completely fine. Sorry for the inc inconvenience. No, it's all good. What'd you do this time, honey? No, I just got me a sleeping bag at the church. Uh, they ain't pressing charge enough. The Reverend, a good man, good man, good man. They ain't gonna press no charge on me, so I'm thankful for that. And then, then he started preaching and stuff and all, and I seen a lot. Super double double. I got the Holy Ghost right here. I'm looking for my. Where is my other one? Hey, man, you there? Yeah, honey, I'm, I'm looking for it. I'm looking. Oh, I get it. I get it. I get it. You good. You good. You good. Poor. Oh, I'm just going to have to do it the other way. I'm going to just have to do it the other way. All right, hold on. Man, that dog made me feel like a poke job. We're going to have to do it the old school way. Okay, so I'm going to go like this. Really? When everything was going good. Hold on. Let's see. Races. Oh wait, did that not puncture oh, sure. dog? Okay. Cool. The other one I not. Oh, I didn't copy it. All right, honey, I'm gonna check your. I'm gonna check your lungs. Your which one? Which lung you gonna check? Let's check your. Let's check your chest lungs, honey. We're gonna we're gonna listen in and see if you, how your your breathing is, honey. Okay, you're about in the normal. Fourteen. Okay. Yeah, I, I, I breathe pretty good. I breathe pretty. I don't, I don't. I don't smoke. I used to smoke. I don't smoke no more. I just be homeless. That's it. All right, give me a second. Let me switch out my gloves, honey. Oops, wrong button. Easy left leg, right, honey? Yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, mama, yep. Left leg. Can I actually sit down on this one? Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and go here. We're gonna do. I'm happy you just stitch it up, no bandage on it, I'll be good as gold. Now this is gonna hurt, honey. It's gonna sting like a hail, but just 
You know, scream, scream for Jesus, yeah, honey. No words, no words in that damn dog bite. I promise you that. Okay, honey. So I see, I see, honey. He bid through good. Um, I'm gonna have to give you a needle for the nerve thing to help help the pain, honey. Um, other than that, um, yeah, I'm gonna. Yeah, some morphine shit. I'm gonna I'm gonna bandage this up. You want to bandage it up, or do you want me to cast it up, honey? No, no, just bandage that cast. Just cast. I fall over. I wear a cast too much. If we wear a cast, honey. You can kick some ass. <laughs> ha! You're pretty funny, girl. You're funny. Um, I think it's stitch a bandage. Just we good. We good. Maybe give us an antibiotic or something like that, so I don't get no function. Some function there, you know. Okay, I'm gonna swallow this, and then in, uh, you're gonna have to look away and just pretend you're looking at Jesus, honey. Oh, I just pray, Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus. Bless this woman, Lord, and her, her gift in hand. Bless him, Lord. Ah, shit. Oh, so that's not about you, Jesus. Ooh. I'm good. Ooh. Man, you got a gentle touch. You got a I don't feel nothing right now. You got a gentle touch. Queens dog bite T slash me. Perhaps. Hell, that's the cleanest my leg been in a long time. That, that's good. And my legs are hairy. I, I had so much dirt on me, I didn't realize how hairy they were. Okay, there you go. Oh, that's better. That's better, Mama. That's better, Mama. Now. One more thing, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna write you a doctor's note. I don't, I know they might take you to prison or jail, what, whatever. But when you get out, honey, um, I'm gonna write you a note for so you can get a couple of aspirin on when you're out, and that will help kill some of the pain and all that too. Uh yeah, yeah. Give me some of them 800 milligram Motrin thing there. Yeah, yeah, for the pain. Yep. But in the future, after you get out, honey, just come up to the pill box. Come talk to the frick. Come ask for Nurse Nancy. Nurse, not Nurse Nancy. Nurse Nancy to be a honey. There's candy here, and we'll, we'll get you set up with stuff. Okay, honey, don't, you know, if you're hungry, right, mama. You, if you're hungry, come see me. If they don't want to feed you, we'll feed you. Oh, you, you soon. I, 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 thank you so much. I appreciate that. All right, so right now, honey, we're going to put you in a gown, and then I'm going to go talk to this, this officer. Oh, fine officer. He might have been an idiot, but we'll see. Okay, yeah, that, that, that Reverend said he wasn't going to charge me with nothing. All right, honey. Sit tight, honey. How's it going, sir? Good. All right, I think he's ready to go, honey. All righty, appreciate it. But um, he he's gonna he's gonna have to use a crutch, a crutch. But you can put him in handcuffs, or you're just gonna help him limping into the car, honey. I'm just gonna have him limp to the car. Yeah. All right, honey. All right, thank you. Sorry for the waste of your time. You're all good. My car got in pain. Ah, where did my car go? Where go? Do we know if patrol ended? <laughs> did, did patrol end? I don't know, but I gotta eat before I die. Alright, so let's go clean up the 
Well, once we're done eating, we're gonna go wash the OR bed, make sure it's clean for the next patient that comes in. But I think we're pretty much at the end of patrol. The clouds look pretty dark out there. Looks like only a storm coming in. But RPing as a doctor? Hell yeah, it's pretty awesome. O R oh no, that's P O R. O R bed. With cleaning wipes. And you're a successful patient. All healed up. I don't know, what do you guys think of this? What do you guys think of uh, Miss Candy playing RPing? At all? What do you think of me RPing as Candy? It's a little different. There you go, Mark. Thank you. Um, I think. That's going to work. I want that. That's going to be a nice thumbnail. And then in the other, the other screenshot I want, it's like, I want my fishies. I want my fishies. Whoa. Those are hot fishies. Alright. At least so here. Um You know what? I'm gonna just log off here. Why not? I'm gonna enjoy this. Oh we gotta have to go get food and water, but oh well. Oh Doctor Baldy, what you doing here again? I thought we told Mr. Clean to go home. Yeah, I had a long day, honey. No, no, I miss Dr. Avery because you're you're an asshole. Yes, I told I told no, I told Dr. Avery he's my awesome one. You know who Dr. Avery is? He he came from Great Great Sloan and now I'm stuck with you. You're like the you're like Dr. Weber, but well, you're a white one. You're like a white Dr. Weber. Yeah. Yeah, you're a little shorter too. Yeah, you can kiss me here. Nope, no, you're no, you can't fire me, honey, because I'm one of your best nurses. I saved four people today. What'd you do? You stand here with your hands crossed, almost on your crotch tape, honey. Yep, I, I, I begged you, yeah, I begged you differ on that one, honey. Yes, I'm coming back. I'm gonna go poof poof, ready? Bye bye, poof poof. No, you're not, you're not watching me. I'm gonna, I'm going in here. And take a nice hot shower, honey. Don't look. Alright, guys. That was that was a pretty good patrol. Hopefully, y'all enjoyed it and something different. It was actually done. I actually I had fun. Like we had, like I said, we had Moon Demon giving us a couple things. You know, you know, um, you know, the RP with um, you know, he sent me a couple of EMS guys to restock the EMS truck. He brought me some bandages, kind of worked out in the same favor. Um, the other thing we was, what did we do? We got, we had fun with, we had something with Jeffrey. We had something with, oh gosh, we had something with Gamer J twice. Ben, it was a great patrol. Are we going to end up doing it down the road again? Next patrol, maybe? Maybe. I had fun this time. One of the best times I actually had fun. 
Um, but until then, guys, thank you all for coming and staying, uh, staying tuned in with SRP 2.0. Um, great, sh huge shout out to everybody that um, we RP do. Stayed in actually RP. It was kind of cool. Thank you, John, for that nice end scene. I would love to use you for a doctor down the road, um, but we'll see. Have a good one, guys. Thank you. Bye-bye.